James, I just thought I'd give you a, send this message over to you just to show you something we did the other day as a result of our conversation. So we updated our crop crossing command, um, which is a tool for cleaning up primarily contours around curb and gutter lines, but or between two flow lines, for example. But you can also use it for these uh, cross sections. Just want to show you that. So we can use the crop crossing command. I've got the grid lines sorted onto a layer. I've got the text so I can see where the grid lines need to be cropped. And then you can say area between two lines. And then you can just click on the first line and click on the second line. And when you do that, that highlights the area that's going to be cropped. You can use this little extend clipping area. And what that does is it adds hundredths to the bottom here um, just so it clips out that little line across the bottom there. And then you can also pick the lines to crop and you can pick them by layer and it will remember that and then update the selection set each time you make a change. So they do close here. And so now it's going to crop out everything apart from the text in, the, in between those two lines. So if I hit apply there, that gets rid of everything there. Now I can just do that two lines for each section. So I just do that one and that one and apply and do the same thing for the next one. Pick that one and that one and apply. And you can see now I don't have to remember anything. I can just scroll through here and doing this for all the cross sections will actually take just a few minutes now to do every cross section in this set of data that you sent me the other day. So again, just more, you know, small changes to tools that we already had, um, but now we can really make this cleanup process a lot quicker and a lot easier um, for this kind of job. So I just wanted to kind of show you that. Um, the crop crossing obviously is a good data prep and modeling tool as it is, but this also means you can use it now for your cross sections work as well, which uh, is a big improvement. So anyway, just sort of let you see that and uh, let you know it's there. That's part of our um, data prep toolbox. So if you need the command, you can buy that from Rockpile from uh, data prep toolbox if you need it. All right, thanks. Bye.